Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys some ways you can use to use Flip a Clip on your PC. So let's get right into it. Flip a Clip is a free application which you can use to create your own animations in several different ways, either on a blank background, on an image overlay which you've selected, you can draw with a brush, you can add text, you can fill in the background, you can create a lot of different things and you're limited pretty much only by your imagination. Uh, you can add audio, you can add other special effects, however you do need the premium version if you want to use all the effects and if you would like to export your movies uh, or your projects rather without the watermark over them. Now, uh, what you can do to use Flip a Clip on your PC, there are two ways. As you can see, I'm using my mobile phone at the moment. Uh, but as you can see, I have selected one of the ways here, and it is to use the BlueStacks mobile emulator on your PC and just get it on the emulator, get it working, and then use it on your PC while emulating a mobile phone. Now, this is a bit more complicated uh, solution to this. However, it is a way that works. Uh, you do need to set some other things such as internet connection in your emulator so that you can upload your actual animations. However, it is a perfectly good way to use your PC as an animation tool. However, there is another way which you can use and it is to actually download it for PC via the Microsoft Store. However, there is only one caveat. I am not showing you how to do this because I can't. My PC is on Windows 10 and to use Flip a Clip, you do need at least Windows 11 and then you can download it to your PC and use it as you would on your mobile phone. Sadly, I do not have the right operating system so I cannot show you. However, that is the basic principle and that is pretty much all there is to it. Let me just show you what it looks like here. And yeah, as you can see, I am in the Microsoft Store. However, I cannot download it because this operating system version is not the minimum requirement. The minimum is Windows 11 version 21990.0 or newer. It functions with everything else. However, you do need the most upgraded version of Windows for this to work or at least more than uh, 21,990.0. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be seeing you guys next time.